Welcome to this episode of Say It With Scott, where we talk about how the words we use affect the lives we live. I'm Scott Siri. I'm a copywriter, and I'm a lover how we can take a word here and there in a sentence, tweak it just a little bit, and dramatically change the message that we're sending. This episode is brought to you by Strategic Advisor Board and by my company, Siri Content Development. Today, we want to talk about poo. That's P-O-O and uh, not P-O-O-H, like the Winnie the Pooh. We're talking about poo. Poo stands for Propose, Offer, Outline. Every time you're discussing something with a prospect, every time you're writing something that's trying to get make them lead them into making a decision, every time you're advertising something that you offer and something that you do, you follow the propose offer outline method even if you don't fully realize it. This concept goes almost across the board no matter what anybody is doing. So let's say as a copywriter, I want you to hire me because it will make you look a lot better and it will provide me with some business. So my proposal might be something along the lines of, I'm gonna save you a bunch of time because writing blogs actually takes a lot of finesse and a lot of work. I've been trained over the last 15-ish years on how to do it, so I can I really know what to put into these things and what needs to happen in order to create the outcome that you are looking for. So my offer to you is hire me, You know, we can do a one-off blog, we can test the waters here, and then we can uh, see how much better my writing is than what you on occasion put out. And then if you really like it, then we can move into a subscription model. So the way this will work is you just give me like some, I will work together, we'll get some keywords and I'll design some topics around this and then I'll write the con content for you, send it over to you, we'll review it and then we can get it on your website and see what happens to it. If you use the right marketing techniques, it should draw in some more people and create more clients for you. So not only are you saving time, but now you're getting more clients, More you have more time to service those clients, which ultimately brings up your income. I, I started with the P, the P-O-O. -O. I proposed what we should do. I offered a trial and I outlined how it would work. It's not something you really want to do when you're just first telling people what you're all about. It's kind of the second step. The first step is just all about them. Why should they care? What is their benefit? Once they're a little bit intrigued, if you scroll back to one of my previous videos, we talk about the intrigue factor. Now you can move into the poo. Ultimately, if you do it right, they're going to be intrigued enough that they will take some action. This can apply to just about any business. It can apply to whether you're trying to get them to sign up for a newsletter or get a free trial or just sign on the dotted line and become a client. Thanks for tuning in to this episode of Say It With Scott. I hope you found some inspiration and education that you can apply to your own business. I understand that this might be a little bit difficult to grasp. It's a whole lot of acronyms that I've gone over in previous videos. So if you're struggling with it, or if you just straight don't want to mess with it, I propose that you hit the link below, you reach out, and I will outline what it is I can do for you. Before you go, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe so, so you'll get notifications every time Strategic Advisor Board posts great new content. Mm -hmm.